Hello, this is Fort 4 with the boys from the north. Uh, me here and the other gentleman, as he wants to introduce himself. Hello. Uh, do you want to give us a bit of a rundown as you've played an hour of this? Because yeah. you're a lucky one. <laughs> like I said, I've only played an hour so far anyway, but like I said, I haven't really done much, so but you've most of it's got to be new. Yeah, but you've been having a look at all the other stuff going on, like all the previews and stuff Maybe. like that. Maybe. Yeah, do you want to get started? We're going right. to start a new game on normal difficulty for people. Our subtitles on before we start. Oh, yep. Yeah. Yeah, we're getting, we're getting more professional than our Aeon Isolation series where we forget to. The generals. No, we just need sub dialogue, don't we? Yeah, we could put general subtitles on, but it depends on. I don't know, just leave it as yeah. like As you can see, this video is going to have two of us basically talking like Muppets all the way through it, so yay! Um, I have yet to see any old Fallout 4, so this is completely new for me. Okay. Um, Lucky. I was a sat in anticipation for the last six months going, I want it now. <laughs> well, unfortunately, I can't even play it on a system, so there's no point in me looking at it because it was like, well, I could look at it and then look at a grand worth of PC and go, I'm never going to get any of these things. <laughs> in time. In time. Oh, yes, in time I will. Oh, wait. Oh, we are apologising for the loading screen. We just felt it was appropriate to start on a nice starting screen. Oh, wait. I kind of want to turn the lights off in here, but <laughs> I don't think that would be a good idea knowing how clumsy I am. <laughs> Do it next time. Uh, so we've not got dim lights. Dim oh, lights. clappers and it's good. <laughs> wow. Oh, hey. Are we on the moon? Or on, no, beach? War. War never changes. Oh, that's pretty. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. This is very good time, this as well, because it's recently wish. been uh, Remembrance Day, isn't it? Yeah, 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 Remembrance Day, so yeah. By dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima. Yeah, the only people that ever drop a nuke, the Americans. How proud the are they to be of it? Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, Portable computers. <laughs> Bunk. In the I'm just looking at my mobile computer, it's not that big. <laughs> People awoke from the American. <laughs> Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing. It's a gorgeous thumbnail that, to be honest, for four at four. War never changes. Oh. <laughs> I envy you because, oh, like, like you so said, sweet. when I when I was playing that, like on the Tuesday morning, like an hour or so after it got released at midnight, I was like, War never goosebumps. Changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the veterans hall tonight, hun. You think? Now we're going to the game graphics. This is just like this is not as pretty as I've been. Yeah, but that was like real life footage, though. Yeah, yeah. I mean, not real life, real life, but yeah, CGI but and stuff. Sure. And we are we going into much detail with? Can you actually be female on this? Or is it just uh, male? Yeah, yeah. No, I'm just curious because. Of, turn, big guy. I, I was just curious because of like the, is this is a new setup for the way they used to do it was like a little monitor with like yeah. this is your kid. So I was just kind of curious of what was going on. Are we going to go with Vanguard the 
the Barbarian of the Waste, so are we going to go with something a bit more? I'll let you decide what uh, we're going to have. Let's have a look at the presets. He looks like a Nord from Skyrim. <laughs> <laughs> Captain America. Oh, look at the Fug Man. The Fug Life. What, oh, Fug Life? The Fug Life. Yeah. Dead Man Eye, look, look at them dead eyes. Let's see, have a look at, let's have a look at the air. And we're going to give him the rough look. Because half the time we wear a helmet anyway, so we never get to see his hair anyway. And yeah. there it is. I think we should go with a white haired, long, long Viking look. Long haired Viking man. Which one? That one, no. I'll let you pick, to be uh, honest. So now, can you get really long beards in this, or do they yeah, not make the really long yeah, Skyrim yeah, beards? Yeah, you can have pretty good long. Oh, big long beard, that'd be awesome with it as well. White, long hair, and it's a lot like some kind of old. But life would be in thingy out of, uh, what do you call it? The Witcher. Eh? The life thingy out of Witcher. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So to you, if you want to use silver or white or just grey. I just kind of want, I would kind of want to imagine our guys are some like battered old war veteran who's seen better days of life. Yeah, that looks right. I was about to say, it looks like he's aging there. With them eyes as well, the sad man eyes, like. Damn, haircut's really working for me. If you say so, mate. <laughs> Thanks, I've seen it, it's all the way down here. Goat beard. Oh, there we go. The homeless man beard. Prepped. Yep, he's dims there, perhaps. Ooh, sprout. Very manly. Yeah, I think, I think we're sorted with our gentleman. I don't know what we're going to call him. You can him. add scars to him. Oh, do you want to just make him all scarred up and stuff? That's like just, I, don't, I don't think we need to I don't think we need to go over the top load the scars. No, like just a blasted scar across the nose. You know, uh, the traditional anime scar. Yeah. Let's have a look. Uh, du -du -du, face. Forgot what it's under now. It's under one of these. You can make him dead big and muscular and everything. Uh, du -du 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 -du, it'd be under extras. Can we make a fat guy? Can we have a fat guy? I don't want a fat guy. I'm not running oh. with a fat guy. <laughs> That'd be so awesome though. Here comes Chumba Wumba. <laughs> oh, that'd be hilarious. Burr attack. Alright, oh, that's alright. We could just have like a general burr. Oof, that's a bit rough. Burns. Yes, that one. That's alright. That's that quite one. nice. That one's on the side of his head. Oh, that looks. That's too nasty. I'm not, I wouldn't like to look at his face when he's talking. Uh, so that's kind of what we want, but a bit more across the nose there. So on the lips. Ah, oh, that's alright, that one. That one. Not that one. Oh, uh, that one. That the one. pirate look. You want that one? It's had the pirate knife. Cecil. Yeah, just give it. Ooh, it would be quite cool now if we could get that left eye and give him Catharox as well. Yeah, I'm with freckles. What's wrong with freckles? Freckles on him. Hey, what you, what's wrong with freckles? I've got freckles. Why, I'm good, sir. I can't get rid of them. Oh, it's all right. We're just leaving with freckles. I don't want freckles. What's wrong Remove. with freckles? Honestly, what's wrong Remove. with freckles? I like freckles. I've got freckles. He's been in the sun for so long. He's getting freckles. You can keep your freckles. Yeah, uh, no, thank you. I'd, I'd like to get rid of them in real life if I could. <laughs> I don't want to put them into a virtual world. Yeah, uh, pod it. Right. Can you actually do like chubby? Really chubby, can we ask? <laughs> <laughs> Skinny man. Muscle up, man. I wouldn't say he's chubby. like super muscle, but I'd say between like muscled and skinny. He's a man who does a bit of walking, but at the same time, he's a man with a bit of. He's a man who's seen things. Yeah. Do you want to put a bit more weight on him? He's had a life of luxury as well. He's got a robot flying around the background. Yeah, that's a bit, that's kind of a normal human look, I'd say. Yeah, he's got like, a bit of weight and he's a bit like healthy. He's uh, seen things. He's a heavy drinker, he drinks scotch. I know the name for him as well. I'll let you choose it. We have to, I'm going to call him Frank. Frank? Yep. How can we call him Frank? I don't know, it's just a manly name, isn't it? Yeah, Frank. Bob's another good name, but Frank, Frank I can feel him as a Frank. I couldn't be really bothered changing. You can change the female as well, but I couldn't be really bothered doing that. I can't set a point, really. You're not going to no. play as a really. No. Let's turn her into a prostitute. Oh, that looks good. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> <Says> so. <laughs> 
Jolly good, Moy, good sir. I've just realised he has two eyes, that's freaking me out, but... He's got three eyes. Yeah, but I've never seen him when they look at you with two oh, eyes. Right. It's freaking me out, I'm like, he has two eyes, that's freaking... Ooh, that's a nice fridge. Ooh, I, I want one. I want one of those in real life. What? A bottle like that with, with Nuka Cola. Oh, right. they, look, they look They've cool. actually brought out Nuka Cola. Yeah, but they don't have bottles like it's that. It's only cool. in America, though. Oh. It's the unfortunate. Well, you'd probably ban it in this country anyway for like too much sugar or something, isn't it? <laughs> health, the health police turn up like, nope, you cannot have that. Oh, we got a baby link. Oh, Play with Sean. Him. Show up, Sean. Oh, look at him. Uh, I think we need to get out of here. I don't want to have to deal with Stinky. <laughs> I think that's the proper name for that, Chid. We're now going to rename him Stinky. You are now being referred as Stinky. Stinky Sean. Uh. Oh, is that Nixon on TV or they use somebody? They've used someone else, right? Alright, that's quite nice. I like the fireplace in there as well, the interior fire to the left. Oh, that, that was quite yeah, nice. The, though. It's a bit wood eight, burner thing, Yeah, it's a bit eighties retro a bit too much. I like the door though, that is styling. That I do like. There'll be people out there going, It's the eighties, that all sixties and they'll look at me going, No, no, that's just wrong. Who's that at the door? We got peeping Tom at our door. Can you get that? <laughs> Just don't answer it. <laughs> Good morning, Vault Tech calling. Are you trying to sell me stuff, mate? Get on your way. <laughs> Go on. Nice to find you, sir. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak. I know he's the the voice actor is doing this voice is the same voice actor who does Uncle Je Uncle Bob or something. His name is out of Ben Ten. It's the same voice actor out of Ben Ten. Honestly, that's just freaky. <laughs> Which is RV. <laughs> I'm here now. So you are. So you are. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a, uh, a precious commodity. Well, you could say so. Time is money, mate. Get on with it. Family service to our country. You have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Sounds fun, but from my history of Fallout, that sounds like a really bad idea. But out of the likelihood of survival, it also sounds really good. There's room for my entire family, right? Of course, of course. Minus your robot, naturally. Oh, poor robot. In fact, what? You're already I, I believe in the rights of robots of equal humanity. Robots are not slaves, they are people. <laughs> you know we treat them like slaves. <laughs> Until the robot is uprising. I'll let you make the decisions here. Can you actually say no to this guy with the vault? <laughs> Imagine if you say like, no, I don't want to go on the vault. <laughs> Can you actually do that as such? I don't know, but... Uh, as you... That's so weird that that moves. <laughs> it's like slurping noise. Like, it's like, sure, come in, come in. Take, just walk up to uh, slap it. Right, so we've got 21 points. Uh, uh, I'd say our guy's quite strong. I'd say about level 8 or 6 on strength between them two. Can we actually choose any of these? Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's 6. 6, six to 8. 6, uh, 7. Uh, uh, athlete, I wouldn't say he's athlete. I say about two. He, 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 he's got a bit of weight two. on him. He's not. He's he drives to places, you know. Yeah. Uh, I'd say he, I'd say he's a bit of a charming fella. Looking at that face. Probably six. Uh, intelligence. Yeah, he's a smart guy. He's been about. He's been around for a while. I wouldn't say he's any genius, but you know, five's a good number to work at. And uh, perception. Um, environmental awareness and sixth sense. And then we've got agility. It measures overall. I'll let, I'll, let you take the, uh, I'll let you take the picks off your... Let's about three for his agility. He, he isn't in his prime anymore. He's gone past that. And that'll be the same for his senses as well. Yeah. Unless you want to put it in luck and take a bit off the strength, take it down to six and then put a lot more into luck. Because luck can be useful in the, in the, uh, in the long game. That looks alright. Yeah, they've got a nice balanced character. I know some people are like, but that's 
boring. Well, screw you, people. Well, we're trying to play the game. We're not trying to oh, die. Like, no, I want to play with a character I actually want to play with, not going. We're just gonna end. We're just gonna end it here. Thanks again. Hey, yeah. It's peace of mind. It's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I, I have my moments. <laughs> Can I speak now? Oh, cut out, baby. You so are really <laughs> stinking. <laughs> Uh, we'll, we'll just end it at this part if that's alright with you, just because we're at the 15 minute mark. Check in with us for the next video to see what bizarre antics are in Fallout 4.